We have many opportunities to post pictures online. For example, we can share photos on Facebook. In our class, our Canvas profile also has a photo. Here is some advice for posting pictures online. This is good advice for both personal and professional social media. First, don't post anything you wouldn't want the whole world to see. Don't post pictures of other people without their permission. Don't take pictures of strangers and post them on the internet. Ask your friends, family, and classmates before posting their pictures. Will you post pictures of your children? This is your choice. Some parents do not want to share pictures of their children. Other parents think it is okay. It is your job to keep your children safe, so be careful with their photos. Always think before you post a picture. Ask, is this picture appropriate or inappropriate? Let's look at some examples of appropriate and inappropriate pictures. Appropriate means that something is correct or okay. Inappropriate is the opposite. It means that something is incorrect or not okay. These pictures are inappropriate. They show too much skin. These pictures are examples of photos that are inappropriate for school use because they show people using alcohol and smoking. These pictures are appropriate. These photos are called headshots because they just show the head of the person. Headshots are good for profile pictures because you can see the person clearly. Let's look at some photos together. Do you think they are appropriate or inappropriate? This picture is inappropriate. It shows too much skin. This picture is appropriate. It is a good headshot. This picture is inappropriate for school use because the man is smoking. This picture is also inappropriate for school use because it shows alcohol. This picture is inappropriate. It shows too much skin. This picture is appropriate. It is a headshot. This picture is also appropriate. It is another example of a headshot. I hope these examples help you see the difference between appropriate or inappropriate photos.